everybody, it's Steve Cook with Premier Guitar and PremierGuitar.com. Are there any guarantees in life? Really? Well, guess what Sadowski's doing? I'm holding the Sadowski Metro Express, guaranteed to weigh less than 8.9 pounds. Guaranteed. I don't know how they do it, but uh, you talk about a shoulder saver, long gigs, uh, those nice three, four, five set gigs that we've all done. Um, nine pounds. It's great. So um, this is a vintage inspired instrument. Um, Let's just dive right in because this is kind of cool. So we have um, we have a reduced size body. We have um, this is an ash body with a maple fretboard. We have this backhoe burst. It's a mint pick guard. Uh, this is Sadowski preamp and Sadowski proprietary pickups. We have their bridge as well, all their hardware as well. And I'm gonna flip this over so you can see. Not much going on back here, that's okay. Just a little belly scoop, that nice tobacco burst, four bolt design. And again, super light, we're throwing this around. Um, where this thing really makes its money is in the preamp, and so let's just get right into some tones. But before we do that, the signal chain today is very simple. It is the Metro Express. Into the Aguilar Tone Hammer using the DI on that, into an Apogee Quartet in the Pro Tools. So we are jumping in with the control set flat. Actually, I didn't even describe the controls, but we'll get there as we get into it. Volume, we'll turn that up. We like that. Pickup blend, we like that too. This would be the bridge pickup to the neck pickup control. Then we have a push pull to bypass the pre. And then we have a vintage, a vintage knob is what they call it. And then they have stacked bass and uh, treble controls. They do not recommend that you turn the treble and bass controls up to 10. So I'm warning you now, don't do that. So uh, why? Because it just gets really, really loud. So, um, all right, so let's jump in. So we've got the pickup set on flat. I'm gonna bypass the pre. It's going to make an audible pop, and they are well aware of this. Easing a little bit of the tone in the bass up. Now a little bit more of this vintage control. And now you hear the bass come alive. I added a little bass on the bottom end of that. But uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use the blend to sort of run through. Okay, that's, I mean, that's a cool tone. Let me see how this blend changes the, uh, the, the tone of the bass. So you've got your neck pickup. bridge pickup. We'll even those back out. Bypass it once again. That's just the neck pickup. And both. And now with the preamp engaged. All that nice snap. A little 
little more travel on there. Super tight uh, B string on that too. So, um, you know, about 1875 is what I think these things run. Um, check them out for yourself. Again, very light, lots of tonal configurations. So if you're a rock guy, funk guy, um, just want to get into the Sadowski pool and you don't have like top of the line Sadowski money, this is uh, the way to get in as well. So um, make sure you check this out for yourself. Check out our written review, check out our, um, check out our magazine. We have a magazine. It's called Premier Guitar. Lots of people read it. But uh, for Premier Guitar and PremierGuitar.com, this is Steve Cook, and I will see you soon. Thanks. Don't forget to sign up for PG Perks, your all-access pass to exclusive gear giveaways and discounts on PremierGuitar.com.